Hi guys, I want to talk about eyelets today. Eyelets, also known as grommets, are these things. You put them in holes that you make in the leather. And I can think of three uses for eyelets. One is ventilation, like what I put here, because if you have a very thick piece of leather in summer, it can get really hot, and you would like some air circulation to prevent sweating. Um, second use would be just for decoration to make your piece of leather look more interesting. And the third use is if you want to attach something, you can use the eyelets as a point of anchoring, cord or lacing, if you want to attach maybe a watch or a pendant you can use the eyelets for that purpose. Now, let's talk a little bit about the different methods for setting eyelets. And I use a setter a lot, mainly for the smaller eyelets. When it comes to the bigger eyelets, I like to use a press. So this is uh, just a part of my eyelet collection and I've got here two millimeters, two and a half millimeters, five millimeters, four millimeters. And there are also washers. These are washers.
When it comes to two millimeters, two and a half millimeters, three millimeters, you will not get a washer. Starting from four millimeters, you will get a washer. So what you get is a set, an eyelet together with a washer. So guys, what I'm going to try to do now is set some eyelets in these old jeans and I'm going to set one with a washer and one without a washer and we're going to see which one is stronger. So this one is going to be with a washer and this one is going to be without a washer. Now let's go over to the press and press them down. Okay, so we will start by pressing the one with the washer. press the one without the washer. So this is the one without the washer and this is the one with the washer and even and we can already see that this one with the washer is going to be a lot more stronger. It's evident why, because he has a bracket and he has more material to grip. This one just came out. doesn't even hold on and this one is a lot stronger I just can't get it out now the reason that they look so weird is because I didn't use the right um, setter I used a three millimeter setter head instead of a five millimeter setter head and that's why it doesn't look nice. It's strong, but it didn't set correctly. And that's why it's important that for every eyelet that you buy, you have to buy the correct setter. The way it should look is like this. That's how it should look. Here's we have a five millimeter eyelet on leather. And if you will notice, I did not use a washer here. And the reason is that working with leather is different than working with just fabric like jeans. And an eyelet can hold on very strongly, even without a washer. Let's try to take it out. See? It's very, very strong. The metal will break and it will continue to hold on to the leather. That's how strong it is. 
even without a washer. <laughs>